hello friends welcome back in the last video we have seen how attackers can get our cookies from our application by injecting some client side codes so here we need to uh, avoid how we can avoid um, stealing cookies from our application so here the cookie is accessible via client side programming so you can see here this is the set cookie and set cookies so the set cookie is uh yeah it's, it's this function will uh, make our cookies and store the value of the cookie so we already know about the first parameter is name second one is value and third one is time when this cookie will expire and the fourth one is a path we will set the path and then the domain so we don't uh, require domain and the uh, secure will be false or you can keep it null too and the last one is the this is the thing we want so the, i want to access this uh, cookie only from http that's why here the name of the parameter is http only and it's boolean type so here we need to make it true then only uh, this cookie will not accessible via client side programming here so these are three parameters username response string to time and here you can see just uh, you go to the browser and just to in use let's uh, remove remove this and you can click here and one cookie in use so just click here and localhost from localhost cookies the username and the value stored in this cookie is Rizwan uh, so we have to uh, uh, we have to avoid from accessing cookies just uh, here press here uh, inspect your browser and uh, elements then console and type your javascript code document dot cookie press enter so you can get username equal to rizwan means this cookie is accessible from client side programming so to avoid we need to uh, we need to make it true http only so the path will be root that's why i'm giving slash so it will be root and then we don't require anything second parameter will be null third will be null and the last one will be true save it refresh syntax error i think we have to pass either blank we can pass blank okay it's this one and uh, here you can see document dot uh cookie so cookies is still available because this is the last cookie we have to remove this one and uh, now let's refresh it now check document dot okay so you can see there is no cookie means now the cookie is not accessible from client side programming um, yeah, so this cookie is not accessible via javascript so thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe